Uh, Senator Josh Hawley, who's the new um, mm -hmm. uh, freshman senator from Missouri, um, said that he would actually team up with our favorite person on the show, Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, right. you know, for legislation. So there does seem to be a drumbeat in both parties towards yes. regulation. 3.9% unemployment rate. And to be fair, Howard Schultz was bringing up some... You know, so <laughs> I, I, I mean, for easy say, I don't need Cheerios, but the... But the ...number on Friday. But the point is, now what? You know, yeah, data-driven right. and, you know, that sort of thing. I mean, I think clearly he's looking at the uh, the global uh, indicators as well, especially... As the incredible thing is that investors are just shrugging off all these privacy concerns and the daily scandals, mm -hmm. right? They don't seem to be bothered by this computer, much less but we're really get, get, get to the technicalities of that to prove it's wrong. We're seeing what privacy legislation... They train the congressmen or the senators they work for, <laughs> and then they still look like idiots when they're up face-to-face yeah. so face with this is no Good and bad when it comes yeah. to understanding technology. Mm -hmm. But when you have have representatives asking the head of Google. Nine percent of its overall merchandise trade surplus. That does not include the trans shipments through Hong Kong. When we get those numbers, and that only get them from the U.S. Commerce Department, that... For some reason, many people in the foreign policy community discounted this. What do you think about the intelligence community saying that there is this new, newfound cooperation? Between also together in Venezuela, a totally different topic. Absolutely. Look, the way I look at this is, um, you know, tariffs are one issue. Relations on getting it uh, before the president did. Now, clearly, Venezuela has been destroyed. Well, he's certainly trying, and he's, uh, he's got the people on his side, and that means a lot. It really does. I mean, you, you think about the protests in the streets just last week when he swore himself in. All over Venezuela there to support democracy, to support freedom. Text of what's going on between the U.S. and Russia and China. Why are these people protesting? Because they're starving. Because they can't give their little babies food. They can't